Uh, it is a difficult area. And the reason it's difficult is because children grow. They need to change. You don't want the couple concerned to be tied to an arrangement which actually isn't in the interest of those children anymore. So you need to have the right type of comment, wording, paragraph, that enables the agreement to acknowledge the changing situation of the contact arrangements or care for the child as that child grows through to 18. And so it is probably dangerous to put in there very prescriptive, precise terms. Often even court orders don't have those precise terms. If they do, they follow up with a, with a paragraph that says there should be such other or alternative contact, for instance, as the parties may agree from time to time. And that's just playing recognition to the fact that the child is not stuck at the age of six. <laughs> they grow seven, eight, nine, ten, up to 18, of course. And all those years, meaning there's very different needs, very different arrangements that need to be made for the child concerned.